Yo, what's going on? In this video, I'm going to be showing you how to turn off notifications for YouTube channels or from YouTube channels that you're not subscribed to. This will also stop you. Well, I'm also going to show you how to not see community posts from YouTube channels you're not subscribed to. Because I've gotten a lot of complaints of people, you know, who have been recommended one of my community posts and like, oh, who's this guy? Blah, blah, blah. Instead of just continually scrolling and going about their business, a lot of sad people like to <laughs> express how sad they are, innit? So I thought I'd make this video to help people out who wanted to know how to do this and wanted to not be sent notifications for other YouTubers that they don't want to see or whatnot. Because I think there was a time a few years ago, maybe last year, the year before, where loads of people were seeing like Logan Paul in their timeline and they were like, no, I'm not happy with this. So now ages later, I'm making the video showing you how to do it in it. So first, I'm going to show you how to do it on the desktop. I had to turn off all notifications from uh, people you're not subscribed to. And then I'm going to show you how to do it on the actual mobile. Now, before we get into it, if you don't know who I am, I'm Jay Carter Ray from growingyoutube.com, teaching you how to be better at YouTube marketing, online business, and music production. I'm a YouTube certified marketer, and I've been able to create a full-time income from my online creative endeavors, and I want to help you do the same if that's something you're interested in. So let's get into it, although this video is about turning off notifications, so it might not help you reach that goal on this. Well, it might keep a bunch of distractions out of your face. So let's get into it let's go to youtube first of all you need to click on your profile picture in the top right hand corner then you need to go to settings then once you are at settings you need to go to notifications on the left hand side and click that and then here is where you'll see all the notifications that you're currently being sent so we can turn off our email updates. We can turn off the general updates, our channel updates, that sort of stuff. We can turn off all, these are all the emails that I unsubscribed from. So like when someone subscribes to my channel, I don't want to see that. Otherwise I just have emails all day of people subscribing and it'll be really, really annoying. My email thing will be like super high. I'll have thousands of emails when that's not what, not the life that I want to live. Um, YouTube premium updates, I don't use that, so I don't really care. YouTube music updates, don't use that. YouTube gaming updates, I think that's gone away. YouTube kids, don't care about that. If someone leaves a comment on my video, I don't want an email for it. I want to be able to check these things when I want to. Otherwise, I feel like these things get in the way of my day, these sorts of notifications, especially when someone's, you know, leaving a super negative comment that you don't want to see at a, uh, a specific point in time. Like, you should... I like to go to the comment section when I'm ready to deal with that sort of BS. Here's some more notifications that you're able to deal with and manipulate and change. So we can actually change so that we're only sent push notifications or we're only sent email notifications or that we're sent no notifications whatsoever. And here's the other notifications that we've got on the desktop. We've got recommended videos, activity on my channel or my videos or channel activity on my comments replies to my comments activity on other channels mentions you probably want to turn off recommended videos if you don't want notifications from channels you're not subscribed to and this should stop you seeing notifications from channels that you don't care about basically so that's how that works but now we need to go over to the phone so that you can actually stop community tab posts coming in to your feed basically community tab posts from people you're not subscribed to specifically here's hoping this works well because <laughs> I, I don't really capture stuff on my phone so here we are we're on the phone and the first thing i need to do is go to my account again so that's top right hand corner i need to click on my face and then we need to go to settings yet again it's the exact same thing that we did on the desktop only now we're doing it on the mobile so we can scroll down and if we scroll down we'll see notifications so we want to click on notifications and then we can turn off our scheduled digest we can turn off subscriptions which is notifying you about activity from channels you're subscribed to you can actually turn or you can manage notifications for each channel that you're subscribed to which you can also do on the computer by clicking manage all subscriptions but we can turn off recommended videos if that's not something you want to see again remember 
but if you've already done that on desktop you don't need to do that on the mobile phone again but the real thing that you're coming on the mobile phone for is to turn off community post suggestions over here now this should stop you seeing community posts from channels that you are not subscribed to so if you are one of those people that moan about seeing community posts from people you're not subscribed to here you are turn it off you don't have to moan about it anymore and if you are one of those people that are moaning about that sort of stuff stop it stop it no one cares no one cares about your moaning, yeah? Instead of moaning, how about you just scroll past things that you don't like? It's a way better way to live. But that's besides the point. You know, if you're that type of person, you're not even going to listen to what I just said there. You're just going to hate and, and dislike the video in it and probably comment some terrible stuff. So you do what you're doing, innit? <laughs> My advice isn't going to break through to you at any point. So that's basically all the stuff that you want to change. And then Bob's your uncle, you're done with that. And that is how you do it. That's how you turn off notifications from YouTube channels you're not subscribed to. But if you are a YouTube channel and you want to learn how to grow your YouTube channel, how to go full time on YouTube, how to turn this into your career, then it's really lucky that you're here because I've made a free course that teaches you the five most important steps to YouTube success. And there's a link in the cards. There's a link in the description. There's a link in the end screen when that comes up. And that's a free course. You can sign up to that. And when you sign up to that, you also get on my daily email list where I share a bunch of gems about being a creative entrepreneur, being a YouTuber, video marketing, all that sort of stuff. So if that's something you're interested in, click on that link or you can go to growyoutube.com forward slash free course. And that will take you to the exact same place where you can sign up for that course. But my question of the day is... How many YouTubers, or how many YouTube channels have you turned notifications on for? Because I think this is a very interesting question. Me personally, I've only turned on notifications for one channel. And if we get enough comments answering this question of the day, I'll reveal who, I, um, who I've turned on notifications for in the comment section as well. So interesting little community thing for us to do. However, in the next video, you're going to learn more about YouTube marketing, online business and music production. So I'll see you there. Peace out.